Hey my elevated babes, welcome to or welcome back to another video on my channel. I am back at it again with another video. In today's video, I'm going to be showing you guys my August budget because we had some difficulties when I first filmed it. First girl, the video was like an hour and a half long. And then second girl, it jumped and uh, it was so confusing. I couldn't even figure out how to salvage it. But yeah, so I'm out to dip in to what i previously filmed for the sponsor of this video and then we'll be right back i do want to introduce this uh product that was sent to me by this one company it's lux luxaza lux a z luxaza i don't know how to say it but i did a, a, a review for model ones and this is a collab that they did with this company here and so this product was sent to me and i actually want to show it to you guys so this is my first time opening it looking at it testing out any of the products so let's go ahead and get this open girl and this is what the palette looks like it is super duper pretty and this is the back of it and if we open it we'll see the colors oh look at those colors let's move this hold on y'all i want to move this piece of thing okay y'all sorry if i blinded y'all with that mirror for a few seconds there but this is the colors i absolutely love the purples I'm about to swatch some real quick. If you do want to see, um, I'm going to put that there so y'all don't get blinded. Um, if y'all do want to see a tutorial of me using these colors on my actual face, let's see. We'll take this one. Then make sure you subscribe to my other channel. It is Golden Beauty XO. So I'm going to take this shade, which is Unfathomable. And then I'm going to take Mellow Purple because I think it's cute. Um, and then we're going to take Molten Pink Cloud. Oh, that one's buttery. Oh, that one's so buttery. Oh, look, that one is so buttery. This pink one. Oh, my Jesus. And let's take Tailored walnut i guess we'll do it on this finger because it'll be easier oh those are so buttery oh that is amazing um and then i think i don't know i think that's it so this one is the tailored walnut let's put it here oh that is a pretty color that's a pretty color this one here is unfathomable. Ooh, it's shiny. Next, I have mellow purple. And then my favorite, which is mellow, I mean, molted, yeah, molted pink cloud. Oh my Jesus, look at that look at that this pink one is so pigmented it is so buttery and so is this these two shimmers um they're not as buttery they are super soft though so all the colors are super duper soft but my favorite so far that i've swatched are definitely these two they are just oh, so soft to the touch as you can see this pink one that was just me doing it once it's so pigmented girl it don't make no sense it don't make no sense how pigmented that is. So, I really think this palette is cute. I'm super excited and I cannot wait to try these colors on my face. If you guys, like I said, want to see me do an eyeshadow look with this palette. It's called the Glimmer Night. Um, glamour, sorry, not Glimmer, <laughs> Glamour Night. Um, then make sure you subscribe to my other channel, which is Golden Beauty. I am taking all of my lifestyle, lifestyle. So beauty, fashion, vlogs, as well as, you know, fitness and travel. All that stuff will be over there on that channel. And so this falls under the beauty category. So if you want to see these colors in full effect, girl, 
go over there go over there and check that video out when it's posted um yeah so i'm super excited for this palette i can't wait to actually do a look with it so yeah now we're gonna go ahead and get back into our regularly scheduled program i'm gonna wipe all this off and i'll see you guys in a few seconds all right, y'all, so now that you've watched that, I'm going to go ahead and show you my budget. I've honestly already did it, y'all, so I guess I'll just go through a run view, like a run through of what I did. So I first started off with my August um, monthly spread. I put down all of my bills. I checked off any bills that have been paid, and up here I put any... Um, money that i spent out of my sinking funds um i also laid down on my payday stickers and i also laid down like my um not my sinking funds i meant to say my cash envelopes my cash envelope category sticker so i can do the check-ins um for me it's easier if i just lay the stickers down as i spend rather than trying to remember or try to write it down somewhere else um so yeah i want to uber so i did put down these uber um these payday stickers because that's when uber pays out hopefully i can get all this done um because i have a trip coming up next month the beginning of next month and girl we need some coins. so i have all of that um I'm gonna zoom out just a little bit um and for whatever reason my five sticker did not cut out right so that's just gone y'all <laughs> that is just gone so we're gonna go and skip over and do, 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 do. okay so this is i haven't decided if i'm going to share my um youtube income and because i previously filmed this i wrote down my youtube income so or my Etsy income. I don't know if I'm sure I'm ready to share that yet. So I did block it. But here, oops, too far, too far. Here are my bills. So the first half of bills here, that gets ready to pay for, um, as you can see, it says nine. So that's going to pay September's bills, except for Xfinity, which will pay August's bill. Therapy, honestly, my therapy ends in September. I'm low key sad about it, but it's all right. Um, and then here are my other bills that I have to pay. I have SBC, Spurbo Prince Co, $34, excuse me, BoxyCharm, $27, Allstate, Disney Plus, Paracel Pending, HP Inc, Photoshop. I have two apples. One is for the music and the other is for extra iCloud storage space. My dad's cable, Planet Fitness, Netflix, and Shopify. So those are all the bills. It told us to $2,334. So that's how much that totals to. And then, um, oh, well, dang. I didn't just told you guys my Etsy one. Oh, well, well, you see what I made for Etsy for this um, particular. So what did I write over there? Uh, I guess y'all see everything. I don't know. Um, That was Etsy, y'all. Whatever, I don't care. I'm still growing on Etsy. That's the only reason why I didn't want to show you guys because I'm still growing, but I'm still growing. So this is just a part of my journey in a sense. So hopefully you guys don't be like, oh, she only made that much on Etsy. Y'all Y'all don't be effing with me like that. Y'all don't be shopping with me like that. So I don't, I, 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 I don't know what to tell you guys because I can only make if you guys support and y'all, y'all, some of y'all don't be. But y'all do because y'all be watching my videos and y'all be commenting. So I can't complain because I'm blessed. Either way, I am blessed and just grateful and just happy that I even have the opportunity to make something, to share a craft, to do with anything, to be in a part of this community. So uh, let me start rambling. That's not what we talking about. Sorry. <laughs> I pretty much break down my bills by um, paycheck. So these are the bills that are going to have to get paid in my first paycheck, rent, Sprint, Insurance, BGE, Xfinity, Therapy, HP Inc., Photoshop, Apple, Dez Cable, Fan Fitness, and Shopify. All is going to have to get paid in my first paycheck of the month. And we're going to fill out this part because initially when I filmed this, it was so long. I didn't want to do this part. I was going to save it to my actual like stuffing videos because the video was already so long. So I'm we might do that now though for real. Um, I ain't mad at it. Okay. Alright. So, there's that. 
and then this is for paycheck too so pretty much the same thing i split my bills up between them and then there's a less bills but still a bunch and then we have to fill out um this bottom section down here so then i have my um let me zoom out just so y'all can see it i have my bi-weekly check-in so this is i can't remember i think it was 15 dollars. i just had my wallet i think because i haven't spent any money out of my toiletries so i think it was 15 dollars. oh i hope and pray nobody saw my card again oh jesus i think it's 15 dollars in here yeah it's 15 dollars in here because i haven't spent any money so i'm gonna go ahead and write 15 dollars but i'm gonna have to spend some money because i need toothpaste toilet paper paper towels all that other stuff and this is not going to be enough so we'll see but i need it so it's just <laughs> it's going to be one of those things that just has to get bought um but yeah make sure and then i decided to do my transaction log like this now there's a, actually a sticker that i made for this but my dumb self didn't think to put the sticker here so i'm just gonna write it like this y'all i <laughs> girl i don't know so then next is when we're going to get into my sinking funds so initially this is like a page for if you want to track your sinking funds like monthly um but i'm going to use this page to put what i'm going to put in each sinking fund bi-weekly so i have i'm probably going to make a new sticker like for um september and october for myself um, but I might give you guys the option to have it but because so over here I have my monthly closeout so I don't really need a sinking fund page and what it's typically used for because I have my monthly closeout so um, I'm just going to use this page to track how much I put into like how much I'm going to stuff that's what I'm going to use this page for so I'm probably going to change this up and probably put paycheck one paycheck two or paycheck three you know however many paychecks it is that month so i think this is what we're going to go ahead and fill together but i'm going to show you what the rest of my pages are so this is the monthly close out here this is social media because i want to start posting on social media more and taking pictures and also keeping up with my youtube so i'm probably going to start writing down video content and ideas when i'm going to put it up all that other stuff for the month of august and this is going to be all my video content and posts and stuff and then i have one for business expenses uh-oh uh-oh i'm not really shopping much for business expenses right now but i have it and then i didn't feel like putting stickers out y'all i was lazy and i did this off camera so i am if you guys watch my condensing video I made this uh, travel binder. So this is for all of my, I went on a trip, right? So I budgeted how much I want each to spend on each category. And I'm going to use my Uber money. I'm going to use my Etsy money. I'm going to use, well, not all of it, but I'm going to use you know my YouTube money to fund this trip. So I have it broken off into categories. So I have, I'm going to get paid four times. If I Uber like I'm supposed to, I'm going to get paid four times between now and my trip. So I broke that down. And then I could put how much it is. The, I have the category here, how much needs to go to taxes, and then how much is going to go into each envelope. So those will all be separate videos. Um, so you can guys can check that out. And then the last, oh, well, I never wrote it. But over here, it's going to be YouTube and Etsy. So I did not write that, but I'll do the same thing like right here, but it's going to be YouTube slash Etsy. So one's going to be my YouTube and then one's going to be Etsy since I get paid monthly for both. So yeah, we're going to go back to um, my sinking funds page. So what I need to do really quickly is, um, I've already showed you that, so we're not pressed. Okay. So what we need to do is add up all of this and figure out how much money we're going to have after our bills have been paid. Let's see if we can get both in the screen because I'm zoomed in. All right. So 630 plus 120, oops, 123 plus 
plus 23 plus 11 plus 70 plus 25 and plus 30 so it's gonna be 12 18 to pay the first half of my bills um 12 18 and so my paychecks are 17 43 so that leaves us with $525 left to budget with. Um, so we're going to write. Um, I kind of need to be able to write. Oops. <gasps> you girls are going crooked. Oh, my bad. <laughs> All right. So we're going to write down our cash envelopes. So I don't normally stuff for groceries because I've been doing HelloFresh as of lately but my hello fresh has been coming in quicker than i actually cook and eat it so i might not do that right now i might wait on that so we're going to do food we're, oops we're going to do spending we're going to do uh toy lit trees we're going to do gas and we're going to do self-care now i have a bunch of appointments that i gotta book and i actually need to book them soon um for my trip even though i don't technically have the money just yet for the trip because the people that i go to they're booking up quick y'all quick so i need to get on it um so groceries um i'm gonna try to just go to the grocery store and shop for my food um so what do i want to give it it's just me I don't know what I want to give it. Spending typically gets $25. Toiletries, I honestly have a bunch to get, but to be honest, by the time I get paid, I probably would have already did it. So we're gonna go ahead and give it $10. Gas gets $50. You know something I forgot to put in Uber? Gas money, because I'm gonna use Uber to replenish gas, but I'm gonna make sure I have some just on the side. Self-care always gets $20. All right, so we have $5.25, right? $5.25. So minus $25. Oh, if y'all want to see what I'm doing. Minus $25, minus $10, minus $50, and minus $20. So we have $4.20 left. Typically, I would put two hundred dollars. So I have a hundred dollars per week, but to be honest, it's just me. So I'm gonna see if I can survive off of one fifty. We'll see. I think I can do it. I only feed myself, so every two weeks, one fifty. That's two seventy. Seventy five dollars per week. Um, I think I can do it. And so then we're going to get into my sinking funds, which is on this page. So I don't want the video to be too, too long, but we're going to go ahead and get into it. So rent gets what it always gets. So I stuff these, but they don't come out of this 270. I already budgeted for it in my bills, but I do stuff them. So that's why they're over here in sinking funds, but they're not actually sinking funds, if that makes sense. So this is 630. I'm just going to write this over here because I know what it is off the top of my head. This is going to be 24. This is going to be 24. This is going to be 123. This is going to be 123. Oops, I wrote 25. Wow. 23. This is going to be 125. This is what I was thinking about. <laughs> this is going to be 125. We try. I'm trying to speed this up a little bit, y'all. So this is going to be 60. This is going to be 60. Um, this is going to be 85. This is going to be 85. This is going to be 50. This is going to be 50. This is always 50. This is going to be 25. This is going to be 25. This is always 25. This is going to be 20. I don't know what I want it for to be for that week. Because this is going to be the week closer to my trip. Uh, it always gets 20. I think we should be fine with 20 actually. That's going to get 20. This is going to get 10. Um... So I think it's okay for that to get 10. So that's pretty much these stay consistent. <laughs> these bills here. 
pretty much stay consistent. So it's going to be these bills, not bills, but these envelopes down here that vary. So I will be going to grad school. I have to get a laptop, y'all. I'm going to have to get a laptop. And I have a couple other bills that I'm going to have to pay for grad school. So honestly, I'm going to give grad school this $70 here. And that's a whole lot of money. But we're going to have to make it work. Um, and savings has to get $50. So things that I know have to get a certain amount. I'm going to go ahead and put that amount over there. Because I give savings $50 every um, time I get paid. Therapy is already budgeted for. And this is going to get 30 And that's going to get 30 It's already been budgeted for. That is a part of my bills. I just... Like I said, I stuff it, but that doesn't come out of this. So we have 125 left to work with. Um, holiday always gets $25. And it's going to keep doing that until after my trip. And I'm going to give Dream Home $25. Minus $25. So we have $100 that we need to work with for the rest of our envelopes. So health, I would love to give $25. That means we have $75 to split between one, two, three, four envelopes. Um, oh, taxes, I don't have to fill out of my paycheck. So um, I'm actually going to put a dash because I actually don't have to fill that through my paychecks. So one, two, three. Oh, I only need three. So each of these will get 25 then. That was perfect. And I'll have to see the amount for those. So we'll calculate that in a second but that's going to be everything that we're going to stuff for the pay my paycheck on the 13th so let's go here these are all my bills so let's quickly add these up like we just did the other one to see how much money we'll have left over so 630 plus 123 plus 125 plus 60 plus 85 plus 30 plus 34 plus 26 plus 13 plus 9 plus 6 plus 3 plus 20 so one thousand one hundred and twenty and sixty four dollars um so let's see one thousand one hundred and sixty four dollars is how much that is going to be um so if we subtract that from what I make, so minus 1743. Um, so 579 is what we have to work with. So 579. And I'm probably going to go ahead and just do the same thing for here. So I think I already put that. So food. What was the other one? Food. Spending. Not me trying to rush this video because I don't want y'all to be here all day. Toiletries, gas, and self-care. So they're pretty much going to get the same thing. I feel like I might should wait to see if 150 works for me, but we're going to have to make it work. <laughs> 25 toiletries is going to get um, $10. I think that's what I gave it. Gas gets 50 and self-care always gets 20. So let's go ahead and subtract this. Minus 150, minus 25, minus 10, minus 50, minus 20. So we have 324 left to work with um, over here. So I already filled in half of these. So we already know um let's see if i can move this over just a little bit and i'm gonna move it back in a second we already know that uh, well actually let me zoom oh that was in my bad i'm still getting used to it my bad y'all so we already know that savings is going to automatically get 50 dollars uh therapy I already budget for it uh holidays automatically going to get 24 i mean 25 dollars and Dream Home is going to automatically get $25. So we have $224 left to work with. Um, again, I really need to get a laptop. Um, 
I'm probably gonna have to take my laptop like out of my savings to be honest which I really don't want to do but it's probably gonna be a thing so unless the only way that I don't have to take my laptop out of my savings is if I give this whole 224 to it the only issue though is by the time I get this paycheck I would have already I would already need my laptop so I technically would have had to do it on this paycheck. How much is currently in my savings? Girl, I don't even know. Trying to figure out life. Cause I mean, I want an Uber. I only have, I have $200 in my savings. So by the time I have this off 250. So the laptop that I want, I think it's like 220. So it would take up all everything that's in my savings. Cause I know I'm at least need fifty dollars out of this to pay for something for grad school. But by this point grad school would have already started y'all not me trying to figure out my life in this video okay i'm gonna put 100 and i'm gonna put back whatever i'm gonna probably take whatever's left over out of student loans after paying for everything that i need for grad school and put it into my savings to kind of help rebuild that because i'm gonna have to use my savings Probably. I'm going to try to Uber though, so if I can get enough money through Uber to pay for it, I'll do it that way, but we'll see. Um, We'll see what happens. Health is going to get 25. I actually have a bill I need to pay. I hate that this is 99. That's going to annoy me. Car maintenance is going to get 25. My birthday is going to get 25. I don't really need date night getting 40. Minus 25. So I'm going to just do it the same. Wow. <laughs> I legit did everything the same except for grad school. <laughs> grad school is the only thing that has different denominations. Everything else is the same. So there's going to be $24 left over. I'm just going to leave that in my account. It is what it is at this point. So yeah, so that's pretty much what I do. Like I just decided to do it all at the beginning of the month. And then at the end of the month, I will put my clothes out here. So I'm not going to probably fill out that column. But I will put my clothes out here. And yeah, so stay tuned for like my Ubering so you can see how much that was. I guess we can write this together real quick. So let's do... Um, I'm going to do YouTube slash Etsy. And because I already know my Etsy, that video, actually this video will be coming up very soon. So, um, I'm not going to fill in any of the totals because you guys will be able to see that in that video, um, when that gets uploaded. So, but I will write that fund and I will put the amount that's going into the fund here. So we have hotel. I honestly should have just did this all together, but it's all right. Spending. We'll pre-fill it out here. Hair. Uber. Nails. Lashes. Wax. And then we have clothes and eyebrows that I don't have envelopes for right now. So that's Etsy. And then we're going to do YouTube right here. Are we, am I in frame? Nope. <laughs> and then we're going to do the same thing. So I think I'm going to just write fund and then amount. And I'm going to write amount again. I did not mean to un underline that, but I did. So that's the thing. Hotel, spending, hair, 
Uber, nails, lashes, uh, wax, clothes, and eyebrows. So, yeah, so you will see me stuffing this one probably in the next couple of days so thank you guys so much for tuning into this video i promise that next week i'll i don't know act, let me know if you like it better like this so if i just do the quick like overview already have pretty much everything filled out and you guys just want to see like the overview of everything um let me zoom out i keep dang it girl and y'all just want to see the overview of everything or if you want me to make separate videos of me fill, filling each part out because if i put it all together it's gonna to be way too long y'all it's gonna be way too long to do all of this all together like on camera so let me know if you want separate videos or if you like how i did it here with just the overview and then we fill out like my uh sinking funds part together so let me know. Thank you guys so much. And I'll see you guys in my next video. Bye loves.